what is up everyone welcome back to a brand new video and in today's video i'm gonna talk about the high energy hero key mapping on game loop emulator actually this game name is apex legends mobile 2.0 everyone knows the name of the game i think so and if you don't know how to download this game and how to play on game loop emulator then i have a video i'm gonna give the link in the description go check out that video and that video will help you to play this game on game loop emulator right now so that's all about the intro let's jump into the main things so here you can see I'm in training ground. Now I'm going to show you how you can edit and fix your key mapping if you have any kind of issue. So for edit key mapping, you have to open the key mapping button from here. So here you can see the click key map button and you have to click it. After click, the key map will be show like this one. Okay. I'm going to tell you an, another problem. The problem is when you start a battle royale match, it's automatically switched to this one. Sometimes this one and sometimes this one. It's automatically switched. So you have to fix both key mapping at the same time right now. Okay. If you fix both the, the key mapping, then you can you can play the game without any kind of key map problem in uh, when you're playing uh, the battle royale match. For that, you have to fix both of them. So I'm going to fix this one first. And after that, you have to copy all of those um, key map from here to uh, this one. Okay. So I'm going to remove all of them from here, all uh, those additional key from here, not every single one. But I'm gonna uh, remove maximum key map from here. Okay, uh, I don't want the scroll wheel, scroll wheel, F, G, E. Because uh, if you want to play Apex Lens Mobile, then in Game Loop Emulator, then you don't need uh, all of those keys to play Apex Lens Mobile on uh, Game Loop Emulator. Okay, so I'm gonna remove uh, the aim button from here too. And I'm gonna remove the Z one. Don't remove the right click, don't uh, remove this one it's called the fire button don't remove this one i'm gonna remove most of them from here f2 i don't need it and uh, three actually i'm gonna remove the three one two and i'm not gonna change anything from here and now i'm going to replace some button so the alt button normally i prefer to mark the enemy you have you should use the alt button because it's so very easy to mark enemies okay so i'm going to remove that alt button and put it over here okay so you have to put your alt button over here to mark enemy actually the enemy mark button over there okay you have to put the alt button over here and one and two over here and i'm going to ch I'm, I'm going to change the four button too i'm going to put the four over here with my one actually it's my kind of three button and you have to put it over here and ctrl you have to remove the ctrl from here and I'm going to put the C button over here. Wait, C, not F, it's C. Okay. I'm going to put the C button over here. And the caps lock, you don't need actually. I don't know why they uh, put the caps lock over here. And the passive ability, I'm going to use E. And the ultimate, I'm going to use Q. Because it's so very easy to use your abilities with E and Q. I don't know which button you prefer, but I love to use E and Q to use uh, passive and the ultimate ability. So if you want to use uh, passive ability with uh, E and Q, it's so very easy to use. So now, if you want to um, sprint with shift button, then no need to change anything over here. Okay, in WASD section, no need to change anything. And if you don't want to sprint with shift and if you want to sh uh, sprint with only W, you don't need to use any kind of uh, additional key for run your with uh, run your character. Then just put your mouse over here and drag to make it like little bit big. Okay, uh, W A S D button. Nothing to do anything. Just make it like this. Okay, if you make it like little bit big, and your shift will be uh, gone from here, and the W only W can make you sprint your character. Okay, so just save it now. Completely. Oh, another things. Open key map and uh, uh, remove the M button and save it. So why I remove the M button from here? I'm gonna show you. Just open your map. Okay. Open your map and the put put your M button over here on on cross button. Okay. Just put the M over here and save it. If you click M, the map will be closed. Okay. Now other things. I have to open the key mapping again and I'm going to show you the aim button. 
where should you put the aim button for put aim button you have to click on it after click on it you will get the aim button over here you have to use um, you can use uh, which button you want to use for um, aim button i use ctrl because i normally use my small finger for unlock my mouse so it's so very easy for me to use ctrl to unlock my mouse so that's why i use ctrl and just save it and another button you should you have to be used so i'm gonna uh, use my f key to use the what it called um zip line and other things open the door zip line and other things so i'm gonna use a button so why should you use the a button if you come here uh, near the row you will you'll get an additional button over here just open your key map and put f button on this key okay just save it and after that your f will be work perfectly you can use the what it called the row and everything's and uh, it's so very easy to use open door and open anything you can use f okay so very easy so that's this is the uh, actually key map this is the actual key map to uh, you can use to play this game so if you want any kind of example like um, the, some gameplay or something you can visit my another youtube channel it, the channel name is only beta buff it's not only beta buff it's my channel name is beta buff so you can visit that uh, channel to watch my gameplay i do live stream over there so you can go and check out my that channel uh, for some example so here you can see I'm, I'm playing the game and i'm not using shift it's my character is running automatically just i'm uh, click click on I'm, I'm press the w button and uh, my character is running and i can slide and i can whatever you want you can do now so you can if you go left you can go left right with on that running speed okay so it's so very easy to sprint and uh, slide jump slide jump it's working perfectly and the left right button i'm gonna use i'm going to take a weapon and i'm gonna show you how you can use the so here you can see i i took a weapon and right click is working perfectly left click is working perfectly so everything is working perfectly so if you use same key map if you use same key map on this uh, key map right now then you can play the game without any kind of problem so this is all about the key map i think you guys understand everything and if you uh, don't understand anything then let me know in the comment section and uh, my english is a little bit weak so don't judge me i'm just trying to show you how you can fix it and how you can play this game without any kind of key map problem and i think you guys understand i hope you guys understand if you are not then let me know in the comment section i always be there and i'm always ready to uh, talk to you so that's all about stay safe bye bye take care